Hey fire signs and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your daily love reading for the 29th of October 2018. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So we'll get going here and I'll tip you down. All right, Spirit Angels, what messages do you have for our fire signs for the 29th of October? Okay. All right, here we go. The Three of Wands, the Nine of Swords, and the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. The Ten of Wands in reverse, the Empress in reverse, and the Ace of Pentacles. The outcome. Wow, the Ace of Cups just flew out of there. The Princess of Cups and the Four of Wands. Wow. The overall arching energy for the day. So I wanted to pop the wheel. Clarified by the Nine of Wands. And the Ten of Pentacles. Bottom of the deck is the Queen of Swords. Um, yeah. The, somebody is could be removing um, an extra person that was in the relationship. Whether uh, that be, you know, uh, like a third party situation. Like sexually. Or it being like a meddling family member or a friend who is just all up too much in your business. Um, you guys are trying to manifest somebody coming back into your life, somebody returning. This is something that you've held a lot of uh, anxiety over, a lot of stress. Um, but, but this is what you wanted. This is, I don't want to say it's like, be careful what you wish for, but now you have the choice between two people. You're stressed out about it. Um, because when they returned, you're not single anymore. You had tried to move on. You had, um, found somebody who, who you really, um, care about. And now you're stressed out because this could be an earth sign that you're, that is returning. Um, and you're either with a fire sign or an air sign now. Let's see. What's this three of wands about? princess of wands. Yeah. So, um, you could be, um, seeing this fire sign, but you've waited a long time for this person to return. And just when you finally, um, are ready to move on, you found somebody that you're happy with, they return and now you're stressing out. You don't know. Yeah. Because you've already healed. You have healed by moving forward. You no longer were going to stay in that stuck, stagnant energy waiting for this earth sign when you have all these different options. You have so many um, people who would love to get the chance to be with you. So you did move forward. You worked very hard to heal. And now they're kind of uh, storming back into your life. Um, let's get one for the Ten of Wands here. The Six of Swords. Yeah, they are getting ready to move away from a uh, commitment that they were in. Somebody that was a, you were a third party in this situation. They are coming back to let you know that they haven't quite fully um, ended this relationship. They could be separated from this person, but, you know, the divorce hasn't gone through or, you know, a situation like that. But they want you to know they are moving towards you. They're traveling in your direction. Um and they want to know that you're going to be there for them. Um, they could be fearing um, losing you if they heard that you are with somebody else. Could be with another Sagittarius as well, fire sign. Um, yeah, they're heart. Oops, they're heartbroken that you now have somebody else. They're getting really panicky. They're worried that this relationship isn't going to get off the ground again. They're worried that they left you and. Now they're going to miss the opportunity to be with you. So they are um, a little heartbroken. They're a little shook up that you have somebody else now 
This um, definitely could be a, a earth sign with the king of pentacles on the bottom. They're going to offer you a new beginning. They're going to offer you, they're going to make you a big offer. Um, yeah, two of wands. And now you're going to have a choice of whether to go. Um, for a long time, you battled for this relationship. For a long time, you wanted this person to choose you, to pick you. And you felt like nothing was going in your favor. But the wheel is here, so it is going to work out for you, whatever you so choose. With the Ten of Pentacles here as well, you are going to have a, a stable family, a stable, happy, healthy home that, full of security and an and emotional bliss, really. Um, but they're throwing a wrench into it because now you don't know which person to choose. Now you don't know what direction to go in. You are at a crossroads, literally. What person do I pick? Where, what do I do? I know the connection I had with this person at one time and it was amazing. I held on for so long for this reason because of that. But, but you accepted the fact that they left and went to somebody else and you spent a lot of time healing. And now that you love yourself, you, you, um, have self-worth, self-love, self-confidence. You had found somebody else and it's just, um, now you don't know which direction to move in this person. Um, yeah, you feel this person is your twin flame or your soulmate. Um, but you don't want to rush back into it because they left you once they hurt you once. Yeah. At the bottom of the deck, 10 of swords, they left you, they betrayed you. They hurt you. They made you promises that they didn't keep. Um, and now they just want to waltz back in and, and offer you this, this, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, like how dare they type um, of feeling. Let's get one for the Ace of Cups here. Even though you are overjoyed that they have come back and that they want this relationship with you, you're very confused because it is going to cause a tower moment in the person that you deeply care for. You deeply care for this new person that you are in a commitment with, but if you want to follow your heart and be with your twin flame, you know, it's going to destroy that person that you love, that you care about. So you're really, you're worried that you're going to hurt this person for one, but you're also worried that if you go back to this person, that they're going to break you and break your heart again. Let's just, let's get one for princess of cups. Yeah. Three of cups. So they, they are going to make you a love offer. If you take it, there will be a, a huge a reason to celebrate. This is um, a twin flame soulmate connection, um, but there was a third party and that is causing you to hesitate because you're not sure if you can believe what this love offer is that they're giving you is, you know, is this going to be for real this time? Because I want stability. I want a solid home, a solid place to go and, and lay my head every night, a solid home and a solid relationship to raise my children. And you promised me that once before and you walked away. So how am I supposed to know if this is what is real? Yeah, because like I said, you promised me this once before and you destroyed me when you walked away. You promised me this once before and you stabbed me in the back. Um, yeah, what's the outcome? The emperor. So it could be an Aries, um, like yourself. Yeah. Secrets are coming out. They're no longer going to hide how they feel about you. Um, oh wow. With the star. Yeah. This is destined to happen. This is a destined relationship. This is fate. Um, knocking at your door. They are, they are back. And look at that bottom of your deck and the hangman. You're going to have to take some time to think about this fire signs. Um, you're not quite sure if you can trust them again. You're going to want them to prove what they're saying to you is true. Don't tell me what I want to hear. Prove to me what you're saying because I've heard it all before and I heard it out of your exact mouth and it didn't come true. I got hurt. I got this tower moment in the process. So don't just tell me, show me what you're going to give me. Show me what you're going to um, to offer to this relationship. So today, guys, you have 
some big decisions coming at you. Um, this obviously does go a couple days before and after, but um, this person is returning, this twin flame, this soulmate with temperance here and the star. It is destined that this person comes back. You also have the wheel, the ace of pentacles, the ace of cups, the, and the ten of pentacles all in the same reading. Um, it's going to be a big day. Four of wands is here as well. Wow. All right. Can I get one card for fire signs? Thank you. Oh my goodness. That one just fell out. Fell right in my lap. Calling in your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations will help bring you guys together. You've been waiting for this moment. You've been praying. You've been working on yourself. You've been healing. You've been hoping and doing the hard work, doing the, the shadow work. And they are here. The time is here. Divine timing with the, the wheel of fortune. Um, it's now time where you're in the decision-making seat. So I do see today you're going to take some time to think about this. Because you don't want to just be told what you're going to have. You want them to show you that this is the life that they're going to give you. So fire signs, very exciting day for you guys today. Um, I hope you all enjoyed your reading and I will say, see you next time.